In a previous video, we fixed this large rust hole. You may have also noticed a rust hole up here, and we threw a patch on that too. It'll just make it a lot easier to do this whole lower section at one time. The next steps will be grinding it clean with a 36 grit or 40 grit fiber resin disc, knocking down all your welds and any other high spots, filling, sanding, DA sanding the edges and further out, and finally priming. Now we'll tap down the seams with a pointed body hammer and feel for other high spots. And I can see it go down as I hit. I'm sort of looking for it to dip down when you give it a whack. And you can hit right on the welds or alongside. Right next to this ridge, we'll use a punch so we can be real accurate. And still, I'm watching for it to dip down.
we have a few low spots to finish up, then we'll DA sand and prime. Getting a large area like this straight can be frustrating for anyone, but if you make sure any high spots are knocked down, you get it very close using a cheese grater blade, and always do your rough sanding with sharp 36 or 40 grit, things will go a lot easier. After a few coats of primer surfacer, this area is ready to be block sanded, primed again, finished sanded and painted. I hope you enjoyed the last two videos on fixing a major rust hole. If you did, 
and you'd like to get my latest videos, don't forget to hit the subscribe button.